Wait, 47. I've been examining Krisha's phone records, and there are quite a few long calls here between him and someone named Voles. Ah, I see. It seems your last contract may not have been as settled as we thought. Evidently, Krish was the front man for Atlantide, and the one responsible for its predatory expansion practices. The man behind the product in the pitch, however, is Galen Voles. Voles stays out of the spotlight, but quietly pushes Atlantide's absurd medical claims on every front, from dry skin to pancreatic cancer. Apparently, Voles recently moved out to the suburbs, to curb the harassment he's been receiving from disgruntled customers and former sales associates. He's also taking advantage of his anonymity to operate an exclusive private practice out of his home, despite having no medical background whatsoever. Perhaps it's time to make a house call, 47. Welcome to Whittleton Creek, 47. Your target is Galen Voles, who's just moved into the neighborhood in hopes of establishing an inconspicuous home clinic to peddle Atlantide. Unfortunately for him, not to mention you, he's already received some threatening mail to this new address. The man's on edge, and he's reached out to the local authorities to help him secure his property. You'll need to get past them if you want to take care of Voles. Ah, Good there. luck. Oh, jeez, darling, I'm so hungry. Have you seen those beautiful patties back there? Look at this place. And Mr. Wilson, you can't stand by. Guys got senses on there. There's no more darn mailbox. Definitely have one in there. Are you, AJ? God. Will some target eliminated? Excellent work, forty seven. Time to make your exit.
Roger, Command. Nothing tangible yet. Still looking. Will do. Out. Well, that's that. Two fewer snake oil salesmen in the world, or exponentially more, if you include their downlines. Well done as usual, 47.